Hi, everyone. I hope this message finds you doing well. I'm David Silver, CEO of Instrumental Wealth. And if you've been watching these videos, we're discussing the 4% rule and why it's flawed and should not uh, necessarily solely be used uh, to judge if you have enough to retire on. And I want to jump right into the third risk of retirement planning, which is inflation. Look, unless you were sleeping under a rock last year or part of 2021 as well, we've all seen inflation spike. And for a lot of clients, they haven't seen this level of inflation since the early 80s, even if you were living at that point uh, uh, to experience it. Things are costing more and more money. In fact, depending on uh, whether you look at the CPI uh, core or headline, inflation last year was up close to double digit percentages uh, by those two measures. And in some areas, if you just look at food and energy costs, certainly in the double digits. And so your purchasing power last year really got eroded because of inflation. If you're using the 4% rule, uh, that doesn't necessarily factor in years where inflation could spike uh, like we've experienced over about the last 18 months and who knows where the end is. So that's another reason that we don't use the 4% rule. In our next video, we're going to discuss how we build retirement plans for our clients from an income perspective. So certainly stay tuned for more content around that. If you've got deeper questions around this, please hop on our website at instrumentalwealth.com. Schedule some time with your advisor. We'd love to have a deeper conversation with you around this. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.